everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Deus Ex Human Revolution. I'm a little bit sicky, but I'm getting over it. I'm almost done with being sicky, but if you hear some coughing, it's because of that. We're going to go do some stuff. Can't actually remember what, our, what we're doing here. We're investigating something, but it's been a while since I've actually done a storyline quest. I did a little bit of side questing, but <laughs> I can't remember anything. Oh, oh, cutscene! Jensen, I... I was on my way out. What's her lady? What are you doing here, Malik? Hi, Malik. I told you I got <clears throat> this one. I know. It, I didn't do anything. Trust me. Van Bruggen's all yours. Hang on a second. Something's Malik. wrong. Malik! Why are you here? It's nothing. <clears throat> I mean, can't a girl have secrets? Malik! Malik! Charm. Malik. Jensen, Malik. If you can think of using that Casey mod on me, I will hit you. Damn it! I wouldn't dream of it. I'm just concerned. That's all. Fine, since you're so damn curious. <laughs> I just used the Casey mod Years on ago, her. I used to live here, remember? <laughs> my friend, on her. my best friend, <laughs> Evelyn. She was like a sister to me. Made living here fun. But then there was an accident. She. She's dead. Uh -oh. I'm sorry, Malik. Wait, Jensen. Let me finish. I thought it was okay with it, but I know. I know she didn't use the Casey bot on every mod. Murdered. <coughs> My damn scumbag boyfriend did it. I know he did. I knew he was trouble right from the start, but she just wouldn't listen to me. Malik, easy. If your friend was murdered, the police would have suspected something. They would have investigated. That's just it. There was no investigation. They said she fell down a flight of stairs like it was some kind of freak accident. But her wounds, the way she died, they don't add up. It's right here in the damn blood spatter analysis. Blood spatter? You've seen the police report. She stole yes. it! <laughs> a friend left a copy of it in a pod here for me to pick oh, up. never mind. Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but I think... I think there's been a cover-up. And we're gonna help her find out. It. If I could get my hands on the autopsy report, the one that never surfaced, I know I'd get the truth. Except... Why do I suspect I'm about to get dragged, dragged into something? Look, Jensen, I'm sorry. I know Van Bruggen is the priority here. And I told you it was my business and I could take care of it. It's just... The more I think about it, the more I realize I'm in over my head. I'm just a pilot. I'm not a damn cop. But I need to know the truth. <clears throat> um, give me some details. Uh, about the task. We're not gonna ask about the reward because that's a dick move. Once you got your hands on it, what were you planning on doing next? I... I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm a pilot, not a cop. But I just... I felt I had to do something while I had the chance. Okay. Maybe once you get the report and we know what it says, we can... Improvise. <laughs> Improvise. Okay. Let's ex let's accept. I like helping, okay, especially when help. it's Malik. What do you need me to do? My lead. He works for <coughs> Lim. He's a systems technician who apparently has access to their entire database. Okay. He's willing to hand over a copy of Evelyn's autopsy report. So you want me to meet him and get the report? Is that it? Yep. Yes, but he'll only respond to a certain phrase. Death and life have their determined appointments. To which he'll reply. Riches and honors depend upon heaven. Christ, Malik, this is starting to sound like something out of a bad spy movie. <laughs> I know. He's it just trying to protect is. himself. I didn't pick the damn quote. So just play along and remember the line, okay? You'll find him inside the lobby of the Lower Hengshaw Lim Clinic. Does this guy have a name? None that I know of. But he apparently goes by the handle Anonymous X. Such know, a bad spy movie. Anonymous <laughs> X. Okay. Bad spy movie. Anything else? Yeah, before I forget, everything concerning Evelyn's incident, newspaper articles, the police report, limb details, it's all inside pod 009 here in the hotel. You should read over everything if you can. Pod 9. Zero, zero, 009. Contact me with any updates and thank you. I really appreciate this, Jensen. Okay, zero, zero, 009. Check pod zero, zero, 009. Is this this? Bonk. D. Okay, we're gonna do the side quest. I said I was gonna try and do side quests off screen, but... <coughs> you know what? Screw it. We're gonna do the side quest here. Because it's Malik. It's Malik, you guys. It's Malik. We have to help out Malik. Because it's Malik. Okay, I think I found it. It took me a minute. I was like, wait a minute, what's all this crap? Okay. I am inside the pod. There is music playing. Um, the rooftop before claims another. 
Now it's celebrating another boyfriend before the incident occurred. A witness whose identity is not released claims she slipped and fell while descending one of the many staircases. So we need to find and talk to that witness. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Probably. Let's go. Everyone should be wary of China. Well, isn't that conceited? Okay, guys, we're going into the limb clinic because we gotta talk to the dude to get information on Evelyn's autopsy report so we can help out Malik. Because we like Malik. Malik, 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 Malik. <coughs> okay, who the hell am I talking to? It's not gonna tell me, is it? Oh, never mind, he's right there. Ha Hashtag Chan! Professional. Death and life have their determined appointments. What? Oh, uh, and riches and honors depend upon heaven. Very good. Right. Yeah, because yeah. that's not suspicious to everybody else watching from the sidelines. Everywhere. Meet me outside the clinic. Turn left from the front and go down the stairs. I'll be waiting at the corner. That was not suspicious at all to everybody watching. No, not in any way, shape, or form was that suspicious. What? What? Game, game, please. Video game, please. All right, I found him. He got out of there pretty quickly. Hi. Over here. Come I can, I now. can see you. I'm literally in your have face, to know dude. They sent a professional, at least. No that problem. Two of us. Right. Well, you're not exactly what I was expecting. Excuse you. I was told I would be meeting a girl. How do I know you're not an imposter or some sort of double agent? Excuse you! I think I don't know. This could all just be an elaborate <clears throat> trap to set me up. Look, no offense, Mr. X, or whatever your name is, but I really don't have time for this. So if you could simply just give me what I came for, I'll be on my way. Yes, yes. I have it right here. Evelyn Carmichael's autopsy report. Yay! Here. Take it. Thank you. I trust you will put this information to good use. Because accountability and justice is at an all-time low. Yeah, afraid. yeah, yeah. It pains me to see this once great city, which stood as a bastion for reform and progress against our oppressive communist origins, succumb to the trappings of corporate bureaucracy and petty corruption. <laughs> corruption so wow. often typical of your Western government. Hey! You uh, now, if you don't mind, rude? I really must be going. Well, there is still the matter of my payment. One thousand credits was the agreed-upon price, I believe. Isn't that right? What? Little piece of advice, bro. Piece of advice. When attempting to extort money from someone, don't give them what they want before trying to rip them off. What? What? You you mean you aren't going to pay? But I risked I everything to get that, that money. I got that money. to a learning experience and move on. You 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 scoundrel! You'll regret this someday. You just you just mock my words. Malik Later. told me nothing Thanks. about a payment. Malik told me literally nothing about a payment. So, yeah. If she said something, I'd have paid the guy. But Malik told me nothing, so he was totally trying to extort money off of me. Oh, right, I have to read the thing, don't I? Um. Newsletter. Autopsy report. Delete. Autopsy report, delete me. Extraction, remove all traces, all is necessary to triumph. All that is necessary for the triumph of evil is that good men do nothing. <coughs> Cranial cerebral injury, scalp contusion, linear pattern of lacerations on the right side of the skull, linear pattern of lacerations on the right cerebral hemisphere. So she had lacerations on the side of her head. Subarachnoid and subdural, um, subdural hemorrhage, small contusions, tips of temporal lobes. So she was stabbed in the head. Vision of left cheek, vision contusion, posterior left shoulder, abrasions, lower leg, blood ethanol undetected, drugs and undetected, asphyxia by Caesar associated with cerebral, cranial cerebral trauma and intracranial hemorrhaging. <coughs> okay. High level of HCG, bloodstream of hormone. Early in early stages of pregnancy, so she was pregnant. 
first trimester fetal development. Her boyfriend killed her because she was pregnant. That douchebag! Molly, I just got the autopsy <coughs> report. No drugs or alcohol in Evelyn's system. And her estimated time of death doesn't fit Lee's story. She did die from a head wound, but not one that matches the evidence found at the scene. I knew it. It couldn't have been just an accident. There's more. Yep. Evelyn was pregnant. Malik? Malik! Here, I... We can't let him get away with this, Jensen. Poor He's bunny. Guilty. He has to be. Poor honey buns. Can you go to his apartment? And do what? Get proof. Get something. I'm sending you the coordinates. Contact me again when you're there. You okay, Malik? <coughs> oh, wait, I think I went the wrong way. And I think I'm getting near to his apartment, you guys. It should be right about here. <coughs> or that's near the area where his apartment is, and I'm going to have to do a whole bunch more walking. Because this game has a lot of walking. Great. Nope, it's just above me. Okay, now I just have to figure out how to get up there. What's beeping? Oh, he's beeping. Never mind. Harvester! Y'all roll. Huh? What do you want meat? Wow, keep walking with this. I think you don't need those legs. Could you not harvest me, please? That'd be nice. <coughs> I'm just trying to break into a dude's apartment. I mean, what's so bad about that? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Kui Kui Guan District. Ah, there's his house. Okay, I'm gonna pop a save. Oh wait, no, I have a quick save, don't I? There we go. <laughs> I'm gonna hack you! Okay, so I need to get there. And to get there, I need to go this, 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 that. Okay. 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 Okay, it's got a lower detection, that's good. Fuck. Come on, just go! Oh, we was about to get to the hub. Oh, that would've been bad. I didn't get any of the extra stuff, though. Oh, well. <coughs> I can pick up his fridge! I have his fridge, I'm not afraid to use it. Oh, it's on the floor now. Never mind. <laughs> Hello? Can I hide in the closet? What if I want to hide in the closet? <laughs> Malik, I'm inside Lee's apartment. I don't Doesn't see anything. Like home. Damn. Okay, look. Lee isn't smart enough to properly cover his tracks, so look around. Ha! Maybe you can find something suspicious. He's not smart enough. Great. Okay. Maybe he is smart enough. Is it in the toilet? No. Is not in toilet. He has a new girlfriend already. Maybe we should warn her that she's probably the gonna hive? get killed. I should have guessed Lee would be there. It's pretty much a second home for him. Wait a minute, you heard that? Sorry, Jensen. I don't like invading your privacy like this. Wait, you heard that? Plus, Excuse this you. gives me an idea. When you're done looking around Lee's apartment, head to the hive. Contact me when you're there. I'll keep looking. <coughs> I'm sure there's more here. Okay. Uh, baseball bat! Malik, I found a baseball bat, but it looks clean. Almost like it's been washed recently. Maybe Lee washed Evelyn's blood off of it. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe there's but residue! I'm not sure it could inflict the type of laceration she had. I'll stick around a bit. I'm sure there's still more to find. Okay. He said that there's still more to find, so there's probably still more to find. Is there something in the fridge? No. <laughs> you just carry the fridge around with me everywhere. It's fine. <coughs> okay, let's hack the shit out of this. Okay, so that... 
but I need to go there, so I need to go boom, 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 boom. Okay. Um, stop. Put this stop there. Let's also do a fortify. We've got to stop, we've got to stop, we've got to stop. Come on, come on! Okay, I want to try and get that guy. Okay, good. Now capture! I should be able to get everything. Oh! Yes! Granted. I like the hacking, you guys! It makes me happy. We fought on before this is the court of the poor because of the family reason. Their family invested in the limb clinic. He must be like all hoity toity. They said this becomes business and surprise. Privately owned after all, because then he follows. Oh, he's an executive. He got it covered up. Okay. Huh. The behavior I've relayed has been disgraceful up until now. I've done everything in my power to support and protect you. Do not change your embarrassing lifestyle. I have no choice but to remove you from both the company and family, meaning no more financial support or immunity. You dishonor us all with your whoremongering. Your father is well, but she is disappointed. She, I suggest you apologize to her. Send flowers. Malik. So they like hit Hong it. Senior was upset with Hong Jr.'s behavior. And threatened to cut off his inheritance if he didn't stop whoring around. Ha! <laughs> Sounds like he can see <laughs> Evelyn beneath the family name. And if he knew she was pregnant, I... I can't believe Lee would do something like that just for money. Probably! Speaking of money, the Hong family seems heavily invested in both Bell Tower and Lim. That could explain the cover-up and lack of a proper investigation. Because money controls everything! To make sure I got everything. Okay, one last sweep, so there's something else here. There's got to be something else here, or he wouldn't have said that. Come on. Come on, evidence. Come on, evidence. Want some evidence. Maybe a secret panel? Or something? Aha! An antique clock! I don't know what this does, but... Malik, I think I got a probable murder <coughs> weapon. A broken clock. The kicker is the hands line up roughly with Evelyn's TOD. <gasps> Coincidence? That's a hell of a stretch. You really think? If we can look at it! Say, maybe. We'd need lab tech analysis to confirm, but if there ever was a smoking gun, it fits. Okay, I think that's it. I'm heading to the hive now. I doubt we'll find anything else in here without calling in a forensics team. Sounds good. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Can I close the door? There we go. He will never know I was here! Never, ever, 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 ever. You know, I've got a funny, a funny little observation. If you go up to the guy, the bouncer, he gets all pissed like, don't you dare try that again with the sneaking in. But they never block the entrance, you can just keep sneaking in every single time, just don't go through the front door. I mean, you can leave through the front door, but you can't enter through the front door. <coughs> okay. Let's go Malik, talk to What's-Her-Face. Okay, your... I'll be right back, you guys. I want to make sure I got everything, because I actually forgot to check. No, I did get everything, never mind. Yeah, he said he got everything. Okay, never mind. Don't listen to me! Where is he? Am I going the wrong way? Where is he? Bouncer. Civilian. I'm looking for what's his face. I don't see any quest markers. I'm used to seeing quest markers. I would rather appreciate having my quest markers back game. It'd be nice. Okay, he's asleep. Not him, he's a harvester because he's a jerk. A harvester because they're a jerk. Harvester because they're a jerk. So many harvesters. Combine harvester! Okay, is that him? No. Where is this guy? Brilliant. Harvester. 
Okay, seriously, where is he? They say the hive serves the this best. This is my first time in the hive. Are you? They say the only of this place. Nope. Is connected. You. No. 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 Ah. Is you? No. Is it you? No. Very impressive. Machine. Where is this guy? Ah, of course he was in the last place I freaking looked. What you want, Chrome Boy? Is your name? <coughs> who? Excuse you. Yeah, maybe it is. Maybe it is. What's it to you? Okay, he's got a little, little bit of Omega. Evelyn Carmichael. A little bit of Omega. Man, it's off. I already told all you. He's a little bit Alpha. Sick. Relax. I'm not with the police. I work private. And you could say I specialize in cases <laughs> like yours. If you ain't police, then what the fuck do you want? A simple proposition. Okay, it's a little bit Omega. That shows you murdered Evelyn. And I want you to pay me two and a half million credits to make that proof disappear. Wow! That's a lot! Oh shit. You ain't got shit on me, Narco. Okay, he's more I'm Alpha. Paying you shit. He's definitely I Alpha. You reconsider. And I strongly suggest you get the fuck out of my face. Because unless you got your proof right here, I ain't got shit to say to you. Alright. Let's start with the police reports. I know your story <laughs> doesn't match up with the evidence at the scene of Evelyn's phone. Oh yeah? And why is that? Um... This stuff is full of inaccuracies. Because it's inaccurate. Because the police report was full of inaccuracies. Like someone deliberately tampered with evidence. Yeah, and? <laughs> that still don't prove shit. It so helps! Not does the evidence not add up, but neither does your testimony. You lied about why Evelyn fell down the stairs in the first place. Um, you said it is, well, oh god, what did he say? What did he say? What did he say? Oh god, I can't remember what he said, I'll be right back. Okay, I looked up the little note thing that had his, like, testimony, and it said that she was drunk, but we know from the toxicology report that she was not drunk. You said you'd both been drinking heavily prior <coughs> to the accident, and the reason Evelyn fell was because she was drunk. We both know that isn't true. Man, that shit was in the papers. Now, Not in the toxicology. The fit and your story was a lie. And how did Evelyn die on that night? Well, the answer is pretty simple, really. You killed her. Because you're a murderer and you're but a scumbag, how? and we're going to catch you. Um, by hitting her with an antique clock. By hitting her in the head with that antique clock you keep so prominently displayed in your apartment. The lacerations on her head, the intracranial hemorrhaging—it's the perfect match. In my apartment. How the fuck do you know what's in my apartment? Don't worry you about it! any good crime of passion, you needed motivation. Something to fuel your violent outburst. What did Evelyn say or do to make you murder her? Said that she was pregnant! She told you she was pregnant, and you panicked. <coughs> Faced with the prospect of losing your easy way of life, you struck out at her in anger. And she died. Oh. That's impossible! Get wrecked! And now the final piece of the puzzle. Why was Evelyn's death never considered a murder investigation? Because your family, one of the wealthiest and most influential families in Shanghai, covered it up. But whose silence did they buy? Um, they bought bell towers... Um, and limbs. Yeah, they bought bell towers and limbs. Limb. Your family's sizable investments in limb assured the autopsy performed on Evelyn's body would never see the light of day. And her death would simply fall through the cracks of an already crumbling justice system. Yep. Fuck this shit, man. And, and fuck you. I can help you, Lee. Get wrecked. But only for a price. Get wrecked, man. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this shit. I'll pay you. You're man. a murderer, okay? I'll pay you just. What do you need from me? I feel nothing Details. from you. You're a murderer. Let me hear your side of the story, and then <coughs> we'll move on from there. I don't. I don't know. Evelyn, that stupid bitch. She was going to ruin me. I... I didn't mean to kill her, okay? Evelyn wouldn't shut up about us, about the baby, so I hit her! I just wanted to make her shut her stupid mouth. But the dumb bitch started freaking out! So I hit her again and, until I... Until she finally stopped screaming. And she was dead. When I realized what I'd done, I, I panicked. She was barely breathing, so I carried her to the stairs near my apartment and... And dropped her. I had to make She sure was still was alive?! Accident. I had no choice! She trapped me. She just wanted my money. I would have been ruined. I need to go. We'll be in contact again soon. Huh? What? What about the evidence? 
and the money. Where the fuck you going? Goodbye, Lee. Don't worry about it, Mr. Lee. Get Shrek! Oh, please tell me you got a recording of all that. Shrek! Oh Jensen, I could kiss you right now. I can't believe you got him to confess so openly. Don't like worry that. about it. To be honest, it was easier than I was expecting. You were definitely right about Lee. He's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed. Nope. Well, don't get too cocky just yet. Before I send our little friend's confession off to the local media and authorities, I want to get some Shanghai street justice first. There's what? a control panel linked to the hive I need you to hack. Uploading the coordinates now. Well, the hive terminal security protocols. Uh-oh. Please don't tell me I'm gonna ruin my pacifist! I'm a pacifist! I don't want to ruin my pacifist. Good thing I auto save because I don't want to ruin my pacifist. Oh, I don't want to ruin my pacifist. I really don't want to ruin my pacifist. Okay, let's not ruin the pacifist. Okay. <clears throat> so I've got to get to there and there. Shit. Okay, that's got to capture level that. Capture level that. I'm gonna go for a. Da 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 da. Okay. I'm gonna go for a nuke on that one. Shit. Come on. Fuck. Hack, 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 hack faster, hack faster, hack faster, hack faster. Give me some spam. Access Fuck! Denied. You saw nothing! Yes! Okay, that took me like six or seven different tries. I ended up u accidentally using one of my nukes. I didn't actually mean to, but I did it! Alright, Malik. It's hacked. Verifying the signal. Come on, come on. Okay, I'm in. Remote frequencies are clear, thank God. Uploading now. Okay, what did you do? And done. What did you do? Hive, Jensen. <laughs> I have a little surprise for our friend Lee. Malik? Malik, what did you do? Malik, do I want to know what you did? Honey buns. Please tell me she didn't kill him. Because I want to keep my pacifist. I want to see if I can get all the way through here with pacifist. Okay, Malik's over here. Okay, never mind. No, she's not. It's just a floating X. The trigger's a cutscene. No. There she is! Let's take this. I was gonna use <coughs> it myself, but after everything you've done, I think you deserve it more. Is so it a Praxis kit? No. I have a it's a Praxis! To tie up, and I need to make sure this autopsy report finds its way into the right hands. The Hongs aren't gonna buy their way out of this one. Lee's confession is solid. With that and the evidence from the autopsy, there's no way he can avoid prosecution. Nope! Justice will be served. Oh, justice will be served, all right. You might want to stick around for a second. I've got one last little surprise for our friend Lee. Um... Are you facing the hive? It's almost showtime. Oh, face the hive. In three, two... Malik. Just watch. I don't... <gasps> Sexual assault, assault with a deadly weapon. Malik. Remind me never to piss you off. <laughs> no, you're right, you never to piss you off. <laughs> For me, you'd have to try pretty hard, mister. <laughs> Achievement unlocked, Shanghai Justice. <laughs> okay! Everybody give a round of applause for Malik. She has done a bang up job on this. But anyway, that is going to be it for this video, you guys. In the next one, I will be in front of the main quest. My name is Miss Girl the Tanager, and I am playing some Deus Ex Human Revolution. I'll see you all in the next video.